I'm one of the rich men north of rich men, people in DC. Ever hear of us? The new song, Rich Men North of Richmond by Oliver Anthony is spreading a lot of misinformation about us very wealthy yet very caring individuals who happen to live north of Richmond. It's the number one song in the country and we don't like it. I mean, we're just out here selflessly trying to serve the public's best interest. But the song tries to paint us in a negative light, saying things like, I've been selling my soul, working all day, Overtime hours for bullshit pay. Yeah, bullshit pay that helps people. It's in your best interest. How else are you gonna own nothing and be happy about it? If you're paid well, you can't just own nothing and getting paid well so you can own things. Like, that's not gonna make you happy. Living in the new world with an whole soul. Yeah, the new world is part of the Great Reset. It helps people out. And living in the new world with an old soul, we have done our absolute best to disconnect people from God and their souls. Hashtag communism will work this time. So even believing you have a soul is a thought crime, according to us. It's the number one threat to our democracy. If your dollar ain't shit, and it's tax to no end, calls a rich man, calls a rich man. Inflation just kind of accidentally happens when you print trillions of dollars, and we think taxes are too low. Did you know that last year, some people took home some of their income? Selfish. When all of that income could be going to Ukraine, which is then fed back to the military industrial complex, which is then fed back to us, the rich men north of Richmond. Which politicians look out for miners and not just miners on an island somewhere. Look out for miners and not just on an island somewhere. That is very offensive to all of us who are on Epstein's flight logs. It's practically hate speech. And the insinuation that child trafficking is a problem, that's just a crazy conspiracy theory. That's why we so desperately tried to silence and smear Sound of Freedom. I mean, if it wasn't such an outlandish theory, then our actions would have us protecting those who traffic minors. And we wouldn't do what we're doing. Lord, we got folks in the street, ain't got nothing to eat, and the obese milk and welfare. Oliver Anthony is obviously against body positivity and socialism. Young men are putting themselves six feet in the ground because all this damn country does is keep on kicking them down. The suicide issue? You mean reducing the carbon footprint by reducing the population? You can trust that those of us who say we always want less people in the world are always looking out for your best interest and we want you to have a long, healthy life. We literally want less people in the world, which means death is the only way to bring about that result. So of course we care about your life because we want more death. These rich men know the rich men. Lord knows they all just want to have total control. Want to know what you think. Want to know what you do. <laughs> we don't want total control and want to know what you think and do. What? Our efforts to work with social media companies where we tell them what to censor so we can manipulate what you think, along with a constant stream of state-sponsored propaganda is all because we don't care what you think. In our surveillance state, which will get a lot more surveillancy once we implement digital currencies, where we monitor your every action and your financial transactions is because we don't care what you do. We use the Patriot Act to monitor you because we don't care what you do. Nothing in this song is true. Rich men north of Richmond, Lord knows they all just wanna have total control. Wanna know what you think, wanna know what you do, and they don't think you know, but I know that you do. I don't think people know. You don't think people really know, do you? Do you wanna be an unhealthy piece of garbage your entire life? Well, me either. That's why I love Bond Charge, a holistic wellness company that offers a wide range of products to help you uplevel your life in every way. And the red light therapy devices are amongst my favorites. Why is that? Because I'm getting old and I injure myself all the time. I always have sore muscles or I hurt myself working out. Most recently, I threw my back out playing pickleball. 
it hurt. Because red light therapy helps with sore muscles, accelerates healing recovery, accelerates recovery from exercise, helps with wrinkles, anti-aging effects on the skin. It helps with sleep and relaxation and a lot more. So it used to be when I would injure myself or I have sore muscles, I'd just sit around waiting, not doing anything about it, helpless, not really knowing what to do about it. So now I just increase my time in front of the red light therapy device. This is the Super Hive Max, which I love. And I find with my challenges like my back, my sore muscles, the red light therapy helps me recover faster and get back in action real quick. And also I'm getting old, I'm 42 and my face looks like it. That's why I've been using the Bond Charge red light face mask. I've been doing 10 minute sessions for the anti-aging effects. And plus when you have this on, nobody's gonna break into your house to rob you. You look a little too intimidating. I'm someone that likes to take control over my health and well-being, doing everything I can, and red light therapy has earned its place in my life as a staple in my health program. If you'd like to check out Bond Charge's amazing selection of red light therapy devices or other health and wellness products, just go to bondcharge.com JP. And while you're there, be sure to use the discount code JP to get 15% off. Happy health to you, my friend.